After last week's drama and uncertainty with the COVID crisis, the Raiders so far have had a normal week of practice to get ready for the Cleveland Browns. They're also seeing some key players getting ready to get back on the field. The Raiders began their week of preparation with some hope of getting closer to full strength. Tackle Trent Brown, who tested positive for COVID-19 last week, is still unable to be at the facility, but will be back later this week. And head coach John Gruden says he could possibly play Sunday. Guard Richie Incognito, defensive back Damon Arnett, and wide receiver Brian Edwards are still likely a week away, but safety Jonathan Abram is back, and Gruden couldn't be more excited. Jonathan Abram is back in the building practicing. So uh, it was a tough week for John Abram, you know. He didn't do anything wrong. Uh, he was uh, obviously held out of the game for precautionary measures, but uh, he's tested negative every single day since July 28th, and uh, our young safety man is ready to roll. And we need him, and we're excited to have him here. Gruden has seen progress with this team despite all the obstacles. It's been a challenging year. I think you guys know that. been challenging for you and everybody else. Uh, we had no offseason. Uh, we really had a virtual draft. We had a virtual free agency, and now I'm seeing you virtually. So we're doing the best we can to um, fast track these players. It's been uh, positive, it's been negative. We've had some growing pains, but we got good guys here. We're going to get better. With the trade deadline looming, Gruden wouldn't tip his hand if the Raiders were going to strike a deal. We're always looking for ways to get better. There's a lot of speculation out there, but reality and speculation are two different things. Um, we're going to continue, like I said, to develop our players. And um, I'm not saying a trade is out of the question, but some of the trades that I've seen thrown out there are, are a bit unrealistic. Gruden wouldn't go into details, but said that he and his staff dove deep into who they have and what they've been doing, saying that fans will see some things this week that they didn't see last week. Kevin Bollinger, Fox 5 News Local, Las Vegas.